Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. I'm your host, Michael Lemo, and today it is Telly Tuesday. Woo woo! Yes, with my boy, Brandon Soriano. What up? Yes. <laughs> so hey. Brandon, as you know, he's done a couple episodes, always great, and uh, he also runs our Reverb, and also orders some of the guitars from some of the um, companies that we order new guitars from, so one of them being Nash. Yes, sir. And uh, so he's going to help run us through these specs, because these are made for our store, so... Yeah, so we have a, a really cool guitar. This is a Nash NRG Blackguard Telecaster. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so Bill Nash is a fantastic guitar builder for many years. Uh, I've yet to play a bad Nash, and I've gotten to play a lot of them working here. Um, but since we are Nash dealers, we can get these brand new. And Norm actually custom orders these. I don't believe Nash really does this for anyone else. Um, it's special wiring and special pickups. So Nash usually defaults to Lawler pickups, and uh, Norm orders these guitars with Seymour Duncan stacked humbuckers. So these, I know what you're thinking, what? Uh, the, these are humbuckers, not single coils. They're stacked vertically on top of one another instead of a side-by-side -side like a, a PAF would be. So with that, you get a neck humbucker, that can split into a single coil, and you get a bridge humbucker that can split into a single coil. And uh, what I like about the Seymour Duncan stacked pickups in particular is that they still sound like a Tele. It really doesn't sound like another style of guitar. It sounds distinctly Tele, but on humbucker mode, there's just no hum and a little more output. They're a little more aggressive, take distortion really well. Um, and besides that, it's basically like a 52 style Blackguard Telecaster, butterscotch blonde. Uh, we do have the necks pretty heavily aged, so it's a nice smooth feel there. You can see the serial number on top. This one is 81, but we got a few of these. Has NRG for Norman's Rare Guitars. And uh, like every classic Blackguard Telecaster, single ply Blackguard, uh, three saddle pieces on there for adjusting. This is actually an interesting design. It's kind of a, almost a flat pull piece single coil there. So on the old Telecasters, you would see flat pull piece pickups where all the pull pieces are flush with one another. It's like a flat surface. Um, and then on like just later guitars, really mid fifties and on, they started staggering the pull pieces, which is what you see now. This one is almost entirely flat except for the D and G strings, which are slightly raised. Not sure why they do that, but it sounds really good and it looks cool. So. Without further ado, I'm going to pass this back to the so dude. This guy. Yes. Dude. Also, we have good news. Norm just showed up from the Costa Mesa Guitar Show with 30 guitars. So that's Woo! why I had to step out. But we'll be posting a video soon. So thank you, Brandon. Let's thank go do this. Right. Let's go. Woo. All right, we're out front with the 2021 Nash T52. It's a Norm Special Tele with a coil split. So you have humbucker. Uh, sounds and also single coil sounds. We'll start off on that neck pickup uh, with the single coil sound and, and I'll hit it in the middle to uh, engage the humbucker sound. Let's see what we get.
it's a Nash T52 a Norm Special Tele with cool coil split, which we uh, explored there. So many options that actually are really effective, um, but really cool. And we I believe we have four of them right now, um, and I don't think they're going to last long. Also, as we covered in the back, check out that cool handwritten NRG serial number. Really cool. So check them all out at normsdirectguitars.com, and also on Instagram and Facebook. I'm your host, Michael Lemo. See you soon. Bye. <laughs> cool.